bit of trouble, man. Uh oh. Don Lemon, man, in a bit of trouble. Don Lemon told Solar Dad O'Brien that she wasn't black and called another woman fat to her face. Damn. Man, Don. He's on a roll. <laughs> yeah, you can't call no woman fat, man. Don't do that, man. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I definitely Did, wouldn't do that. Didn't he just shit on a women's sports too? Don Lemon has their old fucks to give nowadays. Yeah, Don Lemon, he ain't he ain't gonna be long for this world, man. I mean this not this world, but this um he not be long for this, yeah, this woke shit if he keeps doing stuff like that. They're gonna get rid of him. Um they, they gonna have him on Fox News though. Yeah, exactly. we're gonna, at, the, yeah. at the rate he's going, we're gonna see him on Fox News. Don Lemon, Don Lemon used to be conservative back in the day. How he used to talk and shit. Yeah, we, we talked about that. We had I gotta find that clip, man. I need to find that clip, but um, was it the like the Bill Cosby esque uh, clip where he's like, Pull your yeah, pants. yeah, exactly. It was definitely like yeah, that. It, was, uh, it was like back in the it was like back in the days and shit. Like he's trying he to talk about how to. Uh, go ahead, go ahead. No, I was say I was just gonna say like he was just talking about how. Sons need to stop like acting up and being violent in the neighborhoods and like he's just saying real shit like what we talking about right now. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for that clip. If somebody got that clip, bring right. it back to you. Yo, um, I, I I'll make a deal with the son, man. You could keep sagging, but stop robbing everybody. Oh yeah, we gonna keep doing both. So he said <laughs> he said Solar Dad O'Brien wasn't black. Let's let's let me see if that's true though. Cause he he getting he's getting flack for saying Solar Dad O'Brien isn't black. Um, that might not be incorrect. He might if if he got a good lawyer, man, he could he could um, keep his job for that one. Let's see if Solar Dad O'Brien is really black, man. So what is like the That's Solar Dad O'Brien. Why is he getting flapped for telling her she was she not black? <laughs> and why do she want to be black after reading Bob Lee's tweet? <laughs> Real shit, yeah, she crazy. <laughs> woman want to be black? She got out. You 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 don't have to be part of this. Uh, <laughs> but, but then she don't get the benefits that come with it, I. Right? There are no benefits according to Bob Lee. <laughs> oh. <laughs> there are no benefits. But she knows better. She knows there's a lot of benefits. Yeah, there's tons of benefits. Let's see. Let me just hear her talk, man. This is nine years ago. So where did the idea for Black America come from? What was the genesis for the documentary? And uh, the tour as well? The documentary series started in 2007. We started to shoot it, and it was the... She ain't no sister. She only got sister base energy. Hell no. That's, that's a glider. That's, that's a not glider. a sister, man. That's a glider. And it ain't got nothing to do with her light skin because it, it or her bone straight hair. It's just that ain't no sister, man. She don't got sister energy, man. Did you hear her voice? It's going to be the 40th anniversary of the assassination of Dr. King in 2008. And so in 2007, we were trying to figure out, well, what stories could we do? And we decided that a documentary that looked at where we were 40 years after the assassination of Dr. King, kind of assessing not only the atmosphere around the assassination, but also sort of his dreams and hopes where they realized 40 years later what had happened. That was the genesis for the, for the documentary, the first one, which we never knew would really become a successful series. Uh, we're now shooting our seventh Black in America. This one will focus on stop and frisk, partly in New York City. <laughs> Oh God! Sir, <laughs> the stop it for this woman is. She woke up that morning and said, "Hmm, being black is so fucking terrible. I need to fucking do a documentary on stop and frisk." <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, woman? You're fucking. You live in the high life. You got time to talk about stop and frisk. Right. She's I'll, a mulatto. Man. She's I'll a mulatto. I don't know what that for. She looked like she's she white. Like she looked I'll like a fucking. Her. She want to be black. I'll trade with her for a little bit. <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh shit, she's annoying. Everything's about race. She Every... she looks she looks uh blacker than um Megan Merkel. Yeah. Oh my god. Every fucking video of her talking is about fucking race, mom. She talking about Afro-Cuban. 
why she even say a black woman? When they say that Afro-Cuban shit, that make me think that her mom was a mulatto too. That's a system yeah. that changed. Total, no bad. Well, fuck it. I don't My next guest is an award-winning um, journalist. Let me um. Man, <laughs> if, if it was Afro out that way. They didn't want them to move in the neighborhood, right? Right, man. Like, no, I wouldn't want you to move in the neighborhood either, man. Give me a, um, give me a, um, another city, man. We we going to we do we do a couple cities before we get out of here, man. Jesus, pick Christ. any city. Yeah, the wicked man. city. The wicked city is we've seen as ex mayor. Oh, <laughs> Chicago. Oh God, Chicago. I haven't really heard much going on, but let's find out, right? Maybe the summer's already fixing it. I right, maybe shit's you know right already. Facts, man. Um. Dozens of Englewood neighbors together with city leaders voice their concerns outside the new Save-A-Lot grocery store on West 63rd near Halstead. We want fresh food. We want quality options. This is where the Whole Foods moved from, right? Right. So yeah. they, they, they carjacked and stole and looted the Whole Foods out of town. And the Whole Foods was there for like a decade, right? No, nah, it wasn't there for long. It was a okay. few years. But they said they were, they were not making money. Right, and it wasn't safe. So now they, they 